Hey guys, Tom with BuyMeAnIPhone.com back at you today. And as you can see, we've got an iPad here and we are doing a screen shield installation. Guys, this is the crystal film for the iPad. This is from Power Support. You can go check out their website. It's www.powersupportusa.com. Don't forget to put in the USA. So it's Power Support usa.com this is their crystal clear screen shield for the ipad it is 24.95 at their website uh, on their website and uh, it comes in packs of one okay one of the things that i wish they would have done i wish they would have put two in there for like 29 dollars or whatever but uh, as always you know i always appreciate another one but anyway, as you can see, it's a clear static clean film protection, protects from scratches, optical grade films, uh, pretty much, you know, what power support screen shields are like for the iPhone. So what we're going to do is we're going to install this and I'm going to tell you my, uh, my thoughts on it. If it's anything like the uh, iPhone screen shield, power support really uh, stepped up their game and that is a uh, great screen shield for the iPhone. So I expect this will be a great screen shield for the iPad. So what we're gonna do is uh, we're gonna put this, we're gonna clean this off first, okay? Clean it off really nice and good. Okay, and we're gonna tilt the camera a little bit, guys, because as you guys know, I like going from the home button down. So what we're gonna get is we're gonna get a, uh, I forgot my ruler. I like to do this with a ruler as opposed to my trusty dusty um, library card. As you guys know, I really like doing screen shields with my library card. I don't know why, but whenever I don't do them with my library card, I mess them up and then I gotta do it again. I actually did one for my boss at work and uh, for his iPhone 3GS and it, it messed it up and I'm like, I need my library card. So we're gonna tilt the screen, the camera just a little bit more get us in frame here okay. and I think we're good so I'm gonna make sure we don't have any dust residue grime anything on there I think I'm pretty good on the dust and the grime on the residue and the grime so what we have is we have the home button there and one of the things that when I took this out of the box guys it had a bunch of dust on it already which kind of is a little bit of a worry for me because that means there's dust on it already then that dust is going to fall on the screen when i uh when i install it so what i'm going to do is i know i'm not doing this on camera but i'm just kind of cleaning this uh screen shield now to kind of get all the dust off okay, it gives it some uh wetness to it because there was a lot of dust on the screen shield. And obviously if it's on the screen shield, you put it above the screen, guess where that dust is gonna end up? Exactly, right on the screen. So we're gonna give the iPad one more good wipe. And I know you guys are like, boy, Tom, how many times are you gonna wipe this iPad for gosh sakes? But that's kind of how I roll. I like to get it really, really nice and clean of any dust or anything. And if you take a little bit of time at the beginning, guys, doing this, your life is a lot easier because you will not have to try to pull up the screen shield and get those dust particles out. Okay, so now I'm going to just dry it off real quick and then we will be ready to rock. Okay, there we go. Got my ruler. I'm going to take this side and we're going to roll it down just a little bit about a third of the way guys okay roll it down about a third of the way and line up that home button Okay, looks like I got the home button lined up. We're just going to go down slowly. It okay, looks good so far. I 
and there we have it. I think we did a pretty good job. So now, as you can see, I've got a bubble there or two. So now is when I get my library card. You guys know I love my library card. And, oh, sorry about that, guys. And we're gonna see this bubble right there. We're just gonna work that out just like that. There we go, it's gone. See this bubble right, bubble right here? Push it right out, gone. Okay, we got a little bubble right here. Push that out. Okay, and we're gonna work that down just a little bit. That's probably a little bit of dust right there, but we'll, that'll work out. Okay, so there we go. So now, oh, we got a little bubble right here. I'll work that one out. Okay, looks pretty good, guys. So uh, let's clean it up real quick. And let's see what we got. Okay, so we're gonna clean it off. All right, let's turn it on and let's see what we've got here. Oh, not too bad. Very, very clear, crystal clear. Okay. No bubbles. And we got this one little one over here. I think that's a little piece of dust. So I'm just gonna work that out a little bit as we go along. So guys, but as you can see, um, very crystal clear. You don't, you're not gonna have to worry about your iPad anymore. You're not gonna have to worry about it. Now, it doesn't do anything for fingerprints, obviously, but it does help you out to where you're not gonna have a, uh, a scratch in your screen or anything like that. So again, as you can see, very easy to install. That took all of what? Two, three minutes. Okay, this is the crystal clear film for the iPad. And uh, this is from Power Support. Go check out, uh, let me get that in there. Power Support, as I'm sticking to everything. Power Support, go check out their website. It's www.powersupport.com. And it is uh, retail for $24.95 and you get one screen shield in the package. So guys, I think that's a great alternative for uh, people that want a screen shield on their iPad. So guys, uh, I hope this was helpful. If you have any questions, shoot me an email. It's Tom Mosh at buymeaniphone.com. That's T-O-M-M-O-C-C-I-A at buymeaniphone.com. You want to follow us on Twitter, okay? It's twitter.com slash buymeaniphone. If you want to follow me personally, okay, it's twitter.com slash nerf squeezer. That's N-E-R-F, like the football, squeezer. As always, guys, thanks for watching. I hope that this was helpful. So, guys, I guess we'll see you in the next video. And as always, have a great day.